the best way to get something done, if you if it holds near and dear to you that you uh, um, like to be able to. Anyway, I'm, we're going to get a lot done. The, the guy with the shirt, Pootie Tang, man, he's a bad dude. We, we, we got to come together, man. Get this guy. He's got, he's got our cranes. He's got all the cranes. We, we need him for the bigger, better, better, better build back. The build back bit, bit of better. We'll begin immediate construction of a border wall. What a tremendous day here. The Long Island Railroad is screwing up this job. It's a horrible job. I have hired my good friend, John Valente, and his great rifle wounds. They're tremendous people. No, we're doing a great job. We're doing a great job. And we are going to get this job done, and done the right way. Just before we get to questions, I'm supposed to model healthy behavior. I'm going to go grab my coat, and I'll be right back. Uh, just before we get to questions, I'm supposed to model healthy behavior. I'm going to go grab my coat, and I'll be right back. It's nice and sunny, but a little brisk. <laughs> nice and sunny, but a little brisk. And um, talking about the significance of the passage of time. It's significant. And when you try... Okay. And there is such great significance to the passage of time. When you try to explain the significance as a whole. <laughs> <laughs> and there were not, it was a three meter board. And you fell off sideways, you landed on the damp, uh, the darn cement over there. <laughs> and Corn Pop was a bad dude. I remember when I was just a little boy, the year was 1901, I was this big. I remember I was living in a two by four. And I would ride this little snail to work. I would deliver newspapers. We did it. We did it, Joe. We did it. We did it, Joe. You're going to be the next president of the United States. <laughs> You're going to be the next president of the United States. <laughs> oh, sleepy Joe. Well, here we are at the supermarket. We're standing here with the bare shelves. Look at it. There's absolutely nothing here. The shelves are bare. It's empty. It's empty like Sleepy Joe's brain. What do you think about it? Hello there. Is this Sleepy Joe? Come on, man. Who is this? It's me, Donald. Donald, man. What are you calling me for? Get you in the other room. I don't know. It's stupid. Maybe I shouldn't have called. I'm so stupid. Come on, man. You're not stupid. You're stupid. I don't know, it's kind of boring without you. I don't know, maybe I miss you or something. I don't know. Well, you folks miss you too, man, Orange Man. I don't know, maybe we can grab a drink sometime and you give me the codes to the nukes. Roe v. Wade, in its power, has protected a woman's right. Her right. I'm Kamala Harris. <laughs> and when life hands you lemons, you have to expand the Supreme Court. If the court overturns Roe v. Wade, it will be a direct assault on freedom. <laughs> but for real though, for real though, I hate it. Hey guys, if you like smart, nuanced, left-right conversations and interviews in a world where there are very few of those. Do you want to hear both sides of an issue? Do you want to hear people debate it out? Then you need to subscribe to our new YouTube channel by clicking the link in the description or the pop-up button that appears on your screen.